somehow my video feed cut off. So this is part two to the divine spells for uh, battlefield combat. Um, we are on the fifth level spells in the druid, which was the last of it. Uh, we got one sixth level spell to talk about too. So where I last left off, I was talking about uh, fey form could be useful. Uh, replay tracks could be useful to get information. The information wouldn't affect the battlefield unless the information could be deemed good enough to give you an advantage of some sort. Um, but it could help you figure out what happened in what area, how it happened, and so on and so forth, where they went. Um, next is Sturdy Tree Fort. Create a tree with a defensive fort with it, within it. Um, that can be useful for your forces if they're going to be in a forest a lot. Let's look at how many it can hold. It would be expensive to turn this into a lot of one-use items, but the option's there, so. Sturdy tree fort, lasts one hour per level, so it has to last at least eight hours as a druid. You would be about 10th level, so that could last 10 hours. That's more than enough time. It has a foot of thickness for every four caster levels. You create a sturdy building that fits one 10 foot cube for every four caster levels you have. Tree has a hardness of five and 20 hit points per caster level you have. You can designate creatures equal to your caster level, get a plus 10 climb checks. You cannot cast this spell in an area of work stone, though you can cast it in natural surroundings. That would not normally support the growth of large trees, such as a cavern, desert, or a glacier. If it's in a, if you cast this in a forest, it's camouflaged as if it had, as long as its doors and windows remain closed, requiring successful DC 25 perception check. For a temporary thing of housing, that would be pretty useful. For your strike force, that would be the most useful. Um, tidal Surge, create a surge of water to bludgeon foes and extinguish fires. Uh, if they're next to a shoreline, that could be a very useful spell. Um, find a way to put that on a one-use item and activate it when needed. Whether it's something you just toss in the water or something you tap on the shore. Uh, six level druid spells is Fae Form 3. Assume the form of a diminutive or huge Fae creature. Which, the smaller you get with the Fae, usually the more interesting powers they have. Um, so, that's the all the spells. And those are how I would use some of those in a war situation to get it the upper hand. If you have any creative ideas with any of those spells that would augment or give others ideas, uh, put them in the comments below. Until we all game again, guys.